back my youtube channel sales person so this is rohit and today i'm going to show you how to work how to work on native forms in salesforce this is a form builder okay and here you can see so further delay so let's get it started and again please do like share comments and watch this video until end okay so let's get it started so here you can see this is a pack exchange so you have to search like native forms okay so you can see this screen in your side as well so if you want to install this package so just click on the get it now because i already installed this one so i don't want to take another one so that's why so you can click on get it now and you can get this native form once you install that form so you can see this ui like under the app launcher so you have to search like native yeah here you can see native forms right this one so you uh, you have to click on that like native form just click this native form once you click this native form so you have to create your own form as well okay so here you cannot see anything under this recently viewed form so you have to click new and you can create your own form okay so the benefit of this one suppose like uh, if you want to send some survey from end user okay so you can share this link and you can uh, take some inputs from end user so this is a useful for our survey things as well okay so you have to enter your form name like contact form enter the description like this is contact form and which object you want i want contact object so just search and contact and save it so you can see my form is created now and it's open the form builder and now it's time to design your form builder under this ui okay this is the new ui and you can customize each and every components under this form builder okay so before that let me show you first of all uh, how to visible in uh, outside this one so just here you can see this i icon so just click this i icon and here you can see only this logo so you can customize this one as well like just click this one and i want to take this logo in left panel so just click this image alignment and here you can see right you can take your image as well from your sites so for now i am using this default image so you can take anything okay like border color or background color so you can choose this background color as well like i want to take this background color this one okay and if you want to take some margin padding so you can manage from here like top bottom left right like plus and minus okay like this one and this one like that here you can see so you can manage accordingly okay so let me add component here so how to add the component like first just drag and drop functionality is provided by this form builder creator okay and first name last name and let me take email as well or title as well like here you, this one title so here you can see this all field is here let me add one section for this one so let me click with header and just change this section as a personal information like personal info and you can change your text color background color header background color like that so let me change this header background color like this one oh, i want to match this color like that and just drag and drop this field under this one like that here or just here like that okay so you can see under this tab you can see first name last name email and title right so this is the first uh, personal information okay and let me click this add section or you can take from this filter like filter component so like search like submit and drag and drop in particular places i want to take some heights from here like this one and enter this one or just margin padding as you were like this one and change this value like as a submit okay like that and if you want to take some preview of this form how it is look like so just click this eye icon and here you can see this is from 
native form UI. I already built it here. You can see this one, right? So just click this again, and here you can click, uh, and here you can see like submit. And under the submit, you have to uh, just click this one, like uh, this drop down and complete page. So with in complete page, which section you want? So I want like form header first. Okay, or just click here, or just blank at the component just click form header and this header like your request submitted did successfully fully like that okay so based on your requirement you can change this this uh, message okay so i am putting this message here and you can take another paragraph for like please check your email like that please please check your email like that i want to take in middle so here you can see and also if you want to take some images from outside so you can take like i want to take from downloads folder so you can drag and drop that image here so how to check this so here you can see this is my download folder and I want to take this image from here. So just drag and drop here and you can manage this height and width based on your requirement. Right. So let me change this height as well. Like let me change the width of this margin padding left right like that like that or you can take from anywhere as you want plus minus here you can see okay so based on your requirement you can ch change this uh, uh, as well okay this is the way to import your image from here okay so once you click this one so go back and click the page one and just save and next okay so once you save the form so here you can see different types of options like custom link custom action form process so you have to click this custom link for now so just click custom link and once you click this custom link now you have to see this environment or we can say ui okay so it's taking few seconds so don't worry and here you can see different type of options like update a record update or create a related record and create a child record. so i want to take this create a child record so just click and you have to choose your source object name like ob account and child object name like contact i want to take contact here okay like contacts and available form like contact form just click the next and give the form link builder like contact form link and description as you want you can take from here to here and click the next and here you can see save and publish so i want to publish this form and save it so just click this save and publish and here you can see one pop-up is there successfully saved and published and it's generated one default url so let me show you which url i am talking about okay so here you can see this url right so if you want to share this url among the pupils or third uh, third person or we can say that uh, end user and you uh, you can share this for link as well okay so how to do that just copy this link and let me change this mode as a cognito mode here you can see just paste it here and you have to add some account id here so how to add account id so you have to take from here so how to take this uh, account id like just click here and let me duplicate first and just search like sales so let me click this sales now okay once you open this sales application you have to click this account account object tab and now you have to open any record like burlington okay and just skip this and please took this id from the url just copy this id and paste it here and 
hit the enter okay so here you can see one form will be come now here you can see right this one like native form for sales force this is the collapsible tab right and enter the first name right rohit last name kumar email rohit at the red gmail.com something like that title developer something like that and hit the submit once you submit this form you can see new screen as a successfully here you can see your request submitted successfully right and one logo you can manage this logo like height width and you can compress this image as well for now i am using this image so don't worry about it and please check your email here okay so this is the way to create your native form in salesforce and this is how to create your native form for salesforce okay so guys i hope you learned something from this video and please do like share and comments and please subscribe the youtube channel because it's beneficial for me and please take this demo in your side i hope you learn something new in this video okay bye bye see ya